The HTC One is now available in stores nationwide. More leaks of an unusual Samsung Galaxy smartphone emerge. And if you didn't know it, well, Google Glass runs Android. I'm Jaime Rivera, and repeat after me. Thank God it's Friday. This is Pocket Now Daily. This is a great day for a ton of you. The HTC One is now available in stores nationwide. You can pick it up on AT&T and Sprint starting today, and you can also pre-order on T-Mobile as well. This is probably one of the greatest smartphones we've ever reviewed. I'm not just talking about this year. I'm talking about one of the greatest phones we've ever reviewed, period. The phone is that great, and if you're still on the ropes trying to think if you should buy this phone or not, you know what? You shouldn't even be watching this video. You know, just go down to the store, buy your phone, come back, and then film an unboxing for us and leave us a video response. The HTC One is really worth it. Now we obviously know that competition is complicated. The Samsung Galaxy S4 should be available in stores in the next coming weeks as well. And it is a good phone too. And the leaks that we found yesterday of that squared edge Galaxy smartphone continue today. We've also found some more photos of this device and it looks like if the Galaxy S4 and the Sony Xperia Z had a baby. It looks like a big combination of both phones. It sometimes looks like if it was Photoshop. So stay tuned for the rumors. This could probably be the next design. It could probably be a prototype or it could probably be a good hoax. Now let's talk about Microsoft. We do know that the company is already working on their 7-inch Microsoft Surface, but their CFO just came on record right now to state that the company is also working with other OEMs with two different projects. One is to make Windows 8 tablets cheaper, and another is to make Windows 8 tablets smaller, which is an interesting project to come. You just wonder what the company is going to do about Windows RT in that process, because if Windows RT is going to be run on these 7-inch tablets, they won't sell. Now let's talk about Google. We've got recent reports that the company is working on a new gaming platform. We've got leaderboards and other images that show that the company is working with something akin to a gaming platform. The biggest question now is if this will be something that will compete with Xbox, meaning we will get a console, or if we'll be getting something like Game Center on iOS. It begs to wonder what the company is doing, but then when you've got Google doing Fiverr and Google Cable, what's next? I mean, they should even be renting cars. Expect anything from this company. And finally, for the hot news of the day, a lot of us have asked ourselves the same question. Does Google Glass run Android? And Larry Page just confirmed that, well, of course it runs Android. The guy was like, well, what else would it be running? And it's interesting, just think about the future of Google Glass. Could it be that, well, third-party developers could probably build things that Google Glass would run in the future? It's kind of hard to know at this point, but that leads me to the question of the day. Would you buy Google Glass? Is it something that you would like to have? I'll be honest with you, Google Glass, if it were cheaper, it'd be something that I would love to buy. But then again, I just wonder if it's going to be like Bluetooth headsets, you know, those cool things that you once bought and then they all ended up in the glove compartment because once you notice how ridiculous you look using them, you just stop using them altogether. So leave us a comment down below. If Google Glass were cheaper, would you buy it? Of course, like I said, I would, but I'm not sure if I'll actually use it more than a couple of weeks. And of course, for an earlier scoop of everything that's happening in the smartphone and tablet world, make sure you follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can also follow me on Twitter at Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. See you next week. We've got a ton of great content coming up that I can't tell you about just yet.